first headlines. <laughs> All right, this first headline comes to us from the New York Post, and it reads, Priest accused of punching best man at wedding. <laughs> that was the headline, but the honest headline should read, Italian wedding goes off without a hitch. <laughs> Uh, another one from the New York Post. This headline uh, was in the paper and it reads, Horn dogs are desperate to be arrested by this sexy cop. <laughs> that was the headline, but the honest headline should read, F the police. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a headline we read from Time magazine, which said, You can now eat naked in this Japanese restaurant unless you're over 60 or overweight. <laughs> That was the headline. The honest headline should read, Gross unsanitary restaurant thinks it's OK to discriminate about who gets to eat in their pube and butt hair filled <laughs> eatery. <laughs> I said they were honest headlines. They are. Uh, this next one comes to us from the Huffington Post, and it reads, 30 years later, we bet you still can't tell the Olsen twins apart. <laughs> that was the headline. The honest headline should say, Twins look the same is a story. News is doomed. <laughs> Here's what I saw in the sun. Uh, in the sun, and it read, uh, Around the world in 80 lays, traveller bonked her way out of heartbreak after split with long-term boyfriend. <laughs> that was it. Uh, it should have read, Journalist now using the word bonked, news is back. <laughs> Uh, this one comes to us from the Ottawa Sun, and it reads, Brain injury turns Italian man into French man with poor language skills. <laughs> but the honest headline should have said, Adam Sandler has found his next movie. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of does sound like an... It really does, doesn't it? It does. And the next one, this one we saw in the Miami Herald, and it reads, Fight over fart leads to blows at Sloppy Joe's. <laughs> Actually, that headline's pretty honest. It's perfect. <laughs>